Okay, let's call this meeting to order. Y'all please rise on the last Lonnie to deliver our invocation. Lord, we thank you for the opportunity to get together. Lord, we thank you for the rain. And Lord, we thank you for watching over us and not sending abundance of rain as predicted. Uh, give us a chance to correct things that's happened in the past uh, with so much water. But Lord, we give you thanks and praise for all things. Lord, we just ask you to be with us during this meeting. These blessings we ask in your name. Amen. 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 And Tom, would you lead us in the place, please? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you both. I think we've all had an opportunity to look over the agenda. Do I have a motion to adopt the agenda as stated? I'll move to adopt the agenda as stated. I have a motion. Do I have a second? I'll second. Those in favor, aye. So, aye. So be it. I think we've all had an opportunity to look at the minutes from the previous meeting. I would like to entertain a motion that we accept the minutes from the meeting of May 25th, 2021. I'll move to accept the minutes of the meeting of May 25th, 2021. I have a motion to accept. Do I have a second? I'll second. Those in favor? Aye. Aye. <coughs> Carried. Thank you. I do remind you, members of the commission and those in the audience, this is a public hearing, first and foremost. Any recommendations we make, pro or con, are not binding. They are just recommendations. New business. At this time, we're going to conduct a public hearing regarding the request to rezone parcels 041015, 041015, 0401.003, and 041015.003 from C2 Commercial and R3 Residential to a planned <coughs> unit development located at 1317 West Church Street, Jasper, Georgia. And at this time, I'll call on Lonnie to make his presentation. Stand by just a moment, Lonnie. We have David coming in to join us. I'm waiting on the car to show up in the parking lot. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're glad to have you with us, David. Glad to be here. And I do ask that those of y'all who come in, please silence your cell phones, if you would, please as well as sign in if you didn't get a chance to sign in. Okay, we're gonna continue with item A1. Okay, this property, if you recognize it, came through planning and zoning a couple months ago, and it was in the last stage to be approved for development, but a piece of property next to it in the amount of nearly five acres came up for sale the gentleman the developer wanted to purchase that five acres which would expand his development in that area give more room for commercial business growth and also give another entrance and exit out on 515 so this development will have uh, an entrance at 515 and three exits on 53 and three inch. So uh, it will be accessible in several different areas. And as far as uh, rescue, fire trucks, law enforcement, there'll be plenty of uh, access to this development. So they, uh, <clears throat> in doing that, they asked to withdraw before it went to the last uh, meeting before council. And so in doing that, we had to start completely over to include the other property in with the same development. 
So that's the reason this is coming back before you, and they have to go through the entire process again. So uh, we uh, have normally asked under the new ordinances for the applicant to be present. I'd like to go on record that there was a mishap on the date or the timing of this, so they were not able to make this. Uh, I don't know if the date was misquoted or what, but uh, they will be here for the next meetings for any questions that the public or council has. So, uh, Ms. Coleman, you got anything to? We have no, no one has called for or against this project just like the last time. So we have no objections. And so we asked uh, the planning zoning to make a written recommendation to the council. All right. Is there anybody here to speak regarding this property, either pro or con? Nobody here? Any discussion by the board itself? Okay. I'd like to have a motion either to approve and go forward or pass a non-approval message on to the town council. I'll move to approve. All right. Do I have a second? Second. Second. Those in favor, signify by saying aye. 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 So be it. Carried. Thank you. <coughs> we will now go to the second item of new business. This is B1, public hearing, request to rezone parcel JA07051 from C2 Commercial to R1 Residential, located at 197 Chamber Street, Jasper, Georgia. Lonnie, would you take the floor, please? Thank you, sir. Uh, this property, for the ones of you that are familiar, is you cross the Wood Bridge and go out Chamber Street. That All of that property through there is zoned C2 commercial. There have been several instances that people wanted to sell their property, uh, to move to different locations or something, and it creates a uh, problem with the lending institution as far as residential being a commercial. So the uh, applicants have uh, applied for a rezoning. They have taken a uh, old farmhouse out there to remodel it, done some good work in it uh, and everything, and they're wanting to uh, get it completely restored and redone and then put it up for sale as a residential housing. And to be able to do that, it needs to be rezoned. So, uh, is that because... Do we, do we have a staff recommendation? The, the staff recommends that this be approved uh, due to all land use and everything. Also, uh, we are asking for a uh, recommendation from planning zoning to go to council that uh, due to the, the complications of this zoning and with every house out there, there being residential you have a commercial lot on each end but in the middle both sides of the street are residential the, uh, the staff would like uh, permission to contact the adjacent owners and uh, talk to them about, you know, if they'd like to leave it C2 and correct this. So uh, we feel that it would be better suited for everybody out there to be residential if they choose so. Gotcha. But we, we're just concerned about this. Point. This one here we approved. Uh, okay. We, we asked that it be approved, yes. 10 4. Do I have anybody here pro or con? Would you? Keep it sharp now. I will ask you that and speak to the to the board, please. Yes, sir. I'm actually uh, one of the owners of the house. We're in the process of remodeling, like he said, and we we would like to see it zoned residential so that 
when we go to sell it, someone can get a mortgage on it. Um, sure. Otherwise, the, the bank uh, will not let a mortgage be put on it as a commercial, as it's zoned commercial. Gotcha. Thank you. Yes, sir. Anyone else? Does anybody else have something they'd like to say pro or con regarding this? Board, members of the board, any discussion, any questions or comments? Do I hear a motion? I'll move to approve the, uh, the zoning, rezoning request. I'll and, second. And we have a second. All those in favor, signify by saying aye. 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 So be it. It's carried. Well, I'm going to tell you what. That was pretty quick. If you <laughs> were, you were right now to it. Is there? That's everything I have on the agenda. Do I have a motion to adjourn? I'll do to adjourn. We have a motion to adjourn. Second. Second. And I bet everybody says aye. Aye. Thank you very much.